So this is a four bay antenna that I built based on all the YouTube videos. I used very, very thin wire that I had. It's, all, it's the only thing I had, um, but it seems to be working very well. You can see the four bays. So there's one, there's two, there's the third, and there's the fourth. I used the typical uh, pattern I found online where they crisscross on the top and on the bottom. I think it's uh, one and a quarter inch apart. Now here's the difference. So when I first set this up, um, I got the very good reception on all the channels, but I realized I wasn't getting channel 2.1, which after some research, um, I realized that that's a high VHF channel. It's here in Orlando at 2.1 is on RF channel uh, 11, which is high VHF, and I was not getting it. And apparently, after some research, it's because this four bay antenna is a UHF antenna. So I did some digging, and uh, what most people did is they put a VHF right there on the top, a VHF antenna. So, um, but I noticed that some people were using two. Uh, two transformers one on the top and then one in the typical middle connection that's where I used to have the second one uh, and then they would join them with a VHF UHF separator but uh, after some testing I realized I didn't need that I only have one line coming out right now which is from the top there's the VHF antenna with only one transformer and there's my feed line going to the TV and I have pretty good reception from 65% to about 75% on all channels. Uh, there's a TV, I'm gonna zoom in a little bit here. Uh, I'm gonna go to channel 2.1. 2.1. Uh, which is here in Orlando, that's uh, NBC. And when I go to settings to, to see the, uh, the reception, you can see that it's channel 11. And uh, kind of in the way now, so normally that's uh, it's a little bit stronger. I think I'm interfering with the signal now. Let me back up a little bit. But anyways, you can see the channels. You see how I backed up. So there we go. I can't see the number. I think that's uh, 57 or 60 percent. But the channel's coming in really nice and clear on channel 11, which is high VHF. I'm gonna go up to uh, 6.1 which now I'm in the VHF and now it's using the bottom elements. Um, let me go to the settings for that. Settings, which is channel 26, channel 26 VHF. And you can see it there, it's looking great. I'm gonna go scroll down to the highest channel which is 68.4 I think, 68.4, I'm in my porch. By the way, guys, uh, which is why I have to zoom in so much, why the quality is bad. But channel 68 is on RF channel 30. And you can see a very nice signal there. So all the way down from RF channel 11 to all the way, I think the highest channel I have on here is like 45 or something like that. I'm getting them all beautifully, nice and clear, full HD TV using the four bay antenna. 4 bay antenna with the VHF propped on top and basically it's just an extension here I extended the legs up this is four inches right here four inches and they're connected at the one and at one and a quarter separation like the rest of them and the, the uh, extensions are 14 inches each 14 inches in length and then I just use some toothpicks with hot glue to kind of keep them in shape because like I said this wire is very thin I think it's like telephone wire or something well, anyways that's my setup here it's doing great I didn't spend a dime on it it's all stuff I had in my garage well actually I like I bought the transformer on eBay I got two of them for like four bucks well I hope this will help somebody take care